Today is Wednesday, which is Seeking Wednesdays. Oh, your boy slowed down a little bit, didn't it? I just got to listening to uh, Seed Money again. I thank you that I have the $120. I have the $120, and may good come to those all who are concerned. Yeah, he said that if you're asking for the seed money and ask for the tenfold return, you want to always finish with may good come to those who are all concerned. You say you don't want nobody to die, get ran over, and then like that. You don't want money, ill-gotten ways. You don't want money like that. Bro, you don't want it like that. I'm trying to tell you. You want it different than that. Then plus I finished this to the instant millionaire. One of the things he said in that man is that work is meant to fortify the fibers of the mind. And that's the key thing. Not necessarily to make money, it's meant to fortify the mind. And once the fibers of the mind are fortified, the money will come. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm talking about, man. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I've been working for. Looking at, you know, I've heard that over the years. Looking at working, uh, working if you're working for God. My boy Bob Proctor said, "Man, hey, God pays me. The universe pays me. You know, that's what I work for. You know, he said the stuff. He said I'm not looking for for my my payment from man. It can come through men, but not from men. See what I'm saying?" That's what he's saying. So that's what I've been working on. Uh, meditated some more last night. Got down and man, I sure didn't want to meditate last night, man. I almost skipped it. I, I said, man, I've been meditating on this one for a week. Should I go to 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 week three? Week three was 47 minutes and it was like 8.30. I said, 47 minutes, man, I ain't got time for 47 minutes. Then I listened to a portion. I said, man, this sounds a little bit different. I don't know, man. I don't know. Then I was kind of stuck in my limbo, right? Stuck in my limbo. So I said, you know, these are one of the things he wants you to become aware of, the unconsciousness. I know I'm going to grab something sweet to eat. That was one of the things. So I said, man, honey, that's right. I got my cake in there. With in there, cake gone. I say, told my son, hey, where my cake at? Uh, mama said, I told him that was your cake. She said, no, he saved that for me. I said, what? Yeah. I went and asked my wife. She said, yeah. She said, you didn't eat it for two days. Shoot, I figured you were saving it for me. She said, it was good, too. I said, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. What else I got? What else I got? Because I'm still in limbo, right? Still in limbo. Still looking for something to munch on. Because I was supposed to be doing one or two things, printing cards out or meditate or something else. So I went back and uh, got with my son. I, oh yeah, son, hey look. What those Reese's Cups I had on the table last night? I said, huh, Reese's Cup? Pops, I throw them in the garbage. What, man, you throw the Reese's Cups in the garbage? Oh, honey child. I said, why you do that? You don't throw them in the garbage. You put them in this drawer right here so I can find them. In my time of need. I said, Dad, look. They looked a little melted. Some chocolate on Yeah, because I had them in my pocket. He said, look, I told you. Y'all leave this stuff on there. I'm just going to throw the stuff away. Y'all want it. Y'all need to keep it up. When I'm playing the kitchen, I'm just going to play the kitchen. I said, all right, son. All right, okay, okay. I said, I guess that. I said, look. So I grabbed some pecans. I started to eat a handful of Frosted Flakes. But I said, nah, you know what? I just need to get down there. I just need to go ahead and uh, go and meditate. Put my headphones on, going back week two, popped it in, went on meditate 30 minutes. Went on, popped it in, done it, did it. And I was like, oh, I'm glad I did that, knocked it out. You know, cause I gotta do it every day. And guess what I did this morning? Pow, pow, I had broke my six, six day challenge calendar out. I think I'm going to break it out at work. Yeah. But as I was printing cards, guess what I did? I wrote them in my little journal. Keep my little journal with me. 
I'm gonna write in it every day. That's the that's the thing. I may write in it two or three times a day, but the, the main goal is just write in it every day. Every day. Not a part of my planning, but just write down some of these affirmations that I got. You know, just writing it down. Then uh hey, I'm about to kind of get more detail. Say so you, know, you need to get more detail in your life. Yeah, I know that, I know that, but I had been doing it, right? Hadn't been getting more detailed in my life. Oh, oh man, ain't know what time it was. Oh my goodness, oh yeah. And you know, just getting more and more detailed in my life is what I want to be doing. As far as what I want. He said, you need to be detailed in what you want. What you want out of life. You know, like where you want to stay, not the exact address, but that way the house will look and stuff like that, where you want to work, what you want to be doing, stuff like that, the whole nine yards, you want to know all that, you know, in as much detail as possible. Then if you got that detail, then that's fine. If you ain't got that detail, then it don't matter. Cause I'm finna get over here. Get over here. Yeah. More detail on these plans, you know. Seeing how it's going to all pan out, how it's going to all work. Got to have them details in there. The color, the scents, the sounds, the sensations. It's got to be lived and imagined as if it's already happened. I know that. Hopefully this meditation going to get me down to it, man. We just ain't spending enough time dreaming. In great detail. Too busy doing. Too busy, busy. Too busy being busy. Stop and get gas and smell the roses. The whole nine. The whole nine. All right. Peace out. Love you. It's going to do it to it. You hear now. Old news, a couple of Porsche trucks, and some old school. This is hustling music. All right, there we go. See you later.